Hey LHS, I'm Jaren. It's April 19th and here's your Blue Devil News. Congratulations to the following youth and government students. Emma Kate Hall, Isaiah Winfrey, and Rachel Graciani, who won awards for Outstanding Delegate, and Linda Salk, Haley Gatlin, Anne Marie Wilson, June Cabalas, Abby Bryant, Roman Lee, Caleb Durham, and Rachel Graciani, who all won awards for Outstanding Bill. For any students looking for a job, the Lebanon Goodwill and Wendy's is hiring. The Country Living Fair is right around the corner. Country Home Creations is looking for a hard-working, personable, and trustworthy student to work during the Country Living Fair at the James E. Ward Agriculture Center in Lebanon on April 22nd through the 24th. They specialize in dips, so the majority of your duties will per pertain to passing out the dip and answering the customer's question. This job pays $8.50 an hour. You will work 9.30 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. and will be paid Sunday at the conclusion of the show. If you are interested, contact 810-441-3839. Once again, that number is 810-441-3839. Now to Hannah with events and items for sale. Hey guys, I'm Hannah Riddle here with your events and items for sale. The Senior Academic Banquet will be April 26th. You should have received an invitation if you qualified to receive an honor. If you forgot to turn in your response card and money to Ms. Brown or Ms. Pack, you may still turn it in by Thursday, April 21st. May 2nd, all seniors will be invited to a senior breakfast. An honors assembly will follow. We will bring you more details as they come. On May 2nd, the Fields of Faith event will take place. It will be a night of worship and everyone is invited. There is no cost. Prom ticket balances must be paid for by April 22nd. The last day to purchase prom tickets is May 4th. NHS is collecting gently used shoes for New Leash on Life until May 13th. Bring old shoes in and place them in the trash cans that are labeled shoe drive. Now to Jaren with more. Testing will be taking place almost daily. Be sure you are not in the hallways unless, unless it's an emergency. And be quiet and respectful if you have to be. That's it for today. Have a great week, LHS. Enjoy your enclosing segments. Like, what's in the box? This one's kind of like gravelly. It's pretty weird, honestly. It's not something you touch very often. I don't know, like sand. There's like a lot of sand laying around. And this one might be, well, that's just not very pleasant, honestly. It's like slimy, but kind of solid. I'd say snails, but I'm pretty sure you wouldn't put snails in a box for me to touch. So I'll say like bath bombs or something. Yeah. It's not bath bombs. Well, nice, dude. Where do you get breadcrumbs? This feels like um, granola. This is really smushy. I think it's olives. What is it? Oh, wow. Hello, this is Miss Tomlinson, and the big question of the day is, what's in the box? I'm just a little bit shell-shocked. And I've got this on. This is personal protective equipment, just in case it's wet and it's not mine. Serious? It's not anything that's going to get right. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, feels like feels like bladder stones. Yeah, yeah. That's what it feels like. Bladder stones. Yeah. Must be someone who's full of them. Yeah, kidney stones. Okay, this one. Mm -hmm. Eyeballs that we dissected the other day? I don't know what they feel like. No, they're a little small for a sheep eyeball. 
Rabbit eyeball? Did any of the anatomy students make it the rabbit? Okay. Well, there's quite a few of them. Uh, they're wet. Whatever it is, it's wet. So I'm glad I've got the gloves on because it's not mine. And it's wet. And I'm touching it. So, okay. I don't, okay. So that's my final guess. Okay. Thank you. Oh, they weren't cheap eyeballs. Okay. All right. And they were kidney stones. Okay. I want to say a red bowl. And something is in the bowl. Try not to look. Hang on. It's very small items. I'm trying to get just one. Let's see how big. It's almost the size of maybe bird seed, but it's very hard. Um, oh, but it crumbles. I'm going to go with bird seed. I don't even know where I'm looking. Is that the camera over there? Um, I just see words. I don't even see a camera. Um, all right, so that's my guess for that one. Oh, these are grapes or olives. Hang on. Another bowl. Larger objects. I think I smell olives, actually. Um, it is around. It is fruit-like. Um, I think this is a blue bowl in this one. Um, hang on. To the grapes or olives. I'm going to go with olives because I kind of smell some olives going on in there. All right. So bird seed and olives. The olives are a little oily. Olives. Got it. Bread crumbs. Bread crumbs. That's bird seed. That's the same thing. You, don't you feed <laughs> birds bread crumbs? I got it. Two out of two. It's perfect. Absolutely. Yeti eight degrees. I'm good. 100%. <laughs> graduation countdown. Graduation countdown. Hello, it's graduation countdown. <laughs>